Hey what's going on guys, it's Jizo and welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft Pixelmon Alola Adventure and this is episode 2 so it's been a while and that's uh, because I have been busy moving and I uh, my PC broke even after moving so I had to buy another one and as you can see this one can even run shaders so it will make things a lot more fun guys so uh, what, we're gonna, uh, what we did in the last episode uh, we actually picked our team our um, I think it was yeah we picked uh, team Valor the red team and we got a Houndu and a Starly and we picked our chest pin as a starter as you can see on the left uh, side of the screen and we even have a egg that's about to hatch and I got that egg from a I think I, I don't know actually how I got it I just logged in and I had that egg so I think everyone got it on the server so in this episode we're gonna try to get that egg to hatch this actually was gonna be pretty easy seeing as how it already has a crack and we're gonna go and try to level up our Houndur and Starly I fought a Pokemon just now to see how it goes and it, uh, I think Starly gained a level and Houndur too uh, let's go this way and there is a uh, lamp uh, I, think, I don't actually know what it's called we have a full pix over here and some more houndoors but i don't want to go into this like biome or field let's go this way more into the grass and let's try to find some easy pokemon so we can level up and we can go and try to get uh, to defeat some gyms for our team oh a little bit lag there that doesn't matter all right so let's go and throw in our houndoor but well, he's actually pretty weak from the battle i uh, just fought so let's just go and let's go try it anyway let's go for ember and i think he can take a level eight if he doesn't faint in the next episode he will get him and i think he is going to get him let's go use ember again and we got him guys we uh, our starter even got some xp and he uh, went to level uh, 10 and that is because he has a exp uh, experience share so uh, i think he does yeah yeah he has one all right so let's go to the pokemon center right over here or actually i know which can call just spawn and let's go and heal our Pokemon. All right, so let's go and put him in here to the male version of Professor Joy. All right, so uh, let's go. Uh, after that, let's go get out of here, and then we'll just go. And should we go this way? Actually, I don't know. Uh, this is uh, EV training. All right, so I'm just gonna go. No, wait a minute. Is that a Electa Buzz? Yes, but this is just EV training. It will not give us XP. I don't think so. Oh, all right. So we're stuck over here. Uh, I absolutely love these shaders, guys. It really just makes things a lot more fun. And do we uh, a camera up? We can't take a camera up. Not yet, at least. Uh, do, do we see a Pokemon that actually let's go and throw in our chest pin for this one, even though it is a bug type or no, it's called our hunger would be super effective, but I just want to get give Chespin some levels as well. Let's go for rollout and seeing as how that is uh, super effective, or actually not super effective, but still very effective. Uh, a level 19 bell spot. I think we can level up our houndur, houndur just a little bit more. And are we gonna actually get our uh, egg to hatch? I really do hope we can. Let's go and throw it at Bellsprout and let's use Ember. It should be super effective and it actually uses Fine Whip and it's, that is, has more effect than Ember. Well, that's probably because of the level difference. All right, so super effective. Can we get him? I think we can. All right, so, oh no, he already got us. All right, so we're gonna go and send in, let's go and send in our chest pin. Let him use Roll Out. All right, wasn't very effective. That's awesome. Let's go and do it again. And all right, so he got us again. Um, I'm not so sure if Chespin can take him. I think Starly will have uh, Chespin faints. Yes, but let's hope that Starly can take him, guys. All right, so let's go for a wing attack. And it's actually become nighttime. A critical hit on our Starly. We're just unlucky. And um, Starly actually got him and he got 300 XP, level 11. All right, so we're getting those levels on these Pokemon. That is great, but now we should run back to our spawn and heal them back up strength. All right. Actually, the nighttime really is uh, great. I mean, the sky just looks so much better with shaders. Oh, a little bit lag there. Let's go this way, guys, and then we'll go and heal our Pokemon. Uh, is our when is our egg gonna actually gonna hatch? Uh, let's go and throw in our Pokemon and the male version of Professor Joey. I'm just not gonna let this go. All right. So um. When is the egg gonna hatch? I actually want to run some more. So I think we're gonna go this way. I already have the coordinates of this Pokemon Center because there isn't a like a warp command that you can use to go back. So you really do need to write the coordinates for the Pokemon Center. All right, so we're gonna go this way. Oh, we might actually get some. Um, uh, we got some Pokeballs from this Pokestop. So uh, then we have a lot more to go on. All right, so we got. 
three pokeballs and a hyper potion that is great so let's go this way this is a magikarp pond we could get a magikarp and let them evolve into a Gyarados oh man just look at that that actually looks amazing with the shaders just look at the water so we're gonna be using this shaders for all our videos it's gonna be so nice all right so we're just gonna go this way let's just stay on the path just like this sign says what but this is that's a me out uh, i actually want to focus on getting some more pokemon so that we can go and grind the levels maybe uh, i'll do that off screen if you guys don't want me to you should be sure to leave that in the description down below and we're just gonna go this way seeing what the pokemon we can find so i saw actually uh, saw a nuzzle leaf on this server when i was lost so because i went just back to the pokemon center but i saw a nuzzle leaf and i really want to capture him but i failed to do so so we're gonna go and we just try to search for him we'll just leave that in the back of our minds and then we're just gonna go and try to find other pokemon if we can't all right so i'm not seeing uh, a lot of pokemon around or maybe it's because it's dark it really is hard to see uh, other pokemon all right guys so i've been running around for quite some time now and i only found a few pokemon i think i managed to level up some pokemon i'm not really sure because i've been running around for quite some time and i just got uh, a lot of uh, pokey stops and our uh, pokey egg has actually hatched and we have a litwick of level one will we going to there oh we got actually some aaron over here and is that a boss pokemon no is that actually a boss yes it is a boss rare pokemon we're gonna go and show in our starly against him and actually no we should probably go and show in our um chest pin uh, let's go and i actually saw an aaron down there i actually definitely want to catch an aaron let's go for a fine whip and level 22 is a bit too high so i'm thinking i'm just gonna go and run so um it's too bad because i actually want a aaron right now oh a little bit lag uh, let's see that this one is level 20 and this one is level 17 i think we can take the level 17 one it's too bad our chest pin has fainted but let's go and use our um uh, starly and let's go for a wing attack it wasn't very effective actually it wasn't effective at all uh, maybe we can go and use our houndur and hope that he can do something uh, maybe uh, let's go for ember and let's hope we get some damage on him we did get some damage but our houndur has fainted we only have litwick we're gonna go and throw in our ultra ball and let's hope that we let's hope he stays in the ultra ball that is one that is two that is three and he broke free i actually thought we had him all right, so we can throw we can't throw our uh, pokeballs at Pokemon on this server. So we're just gonna go back to the Pokemon Center real quick, and then we're just gonna go and uh, go back, and we're gonna capture the Pokemon. So I wanna go and look at our Pokemon's natures and just their growth rate, like if they're ordinary, huge, and just their natures, whether they are adamant. Let's hope some of them are adamant or uh, just all kinds of other nature so we're gonna do that after we heal up go back catch that Aaron and I think I also saw a nose leaf in the background so I found the biome that I was searching for and that's great now we just need to go back as quickly as possible and capture those Pokemon so that we have almost a full team so if you guys want uh, if you guys want me to keep using Litwick be sure to leave it in the comment section down below I'm actually starting to doubt it, seeing as how he is only level 1 and Litwick is not even that rare of a Pokemon. So um, just tell me in the comment section and I will do what the most people are saying, are telling me to do. So let's go back to where we were. I think we were around here. I think we were there, yeah. Let's hope that Aaron hasn't uh, despawned just yet. And are they still here? I think... Oh, that is a Ekans. Do we see a Aaron around here? Yes, we... There is a Aaron over here, level 17. I think we can take him. So we're just gonna go and use our chest pin. We're gonna throw him at him. Let's go for a final whip and let's hope that our chest pin survives. No, he doesn't. Let's go for Houndur. Let him use Ember. And it is not very effective, but still it has some effect. We're gonna go for Starly and we're gonna keep using our Ultra Balls to throw at him and let's hope we get him. So we're seeing the Ultra Ball, that is one. That is two, and he broke free. Uses Rock Tom on our Starly. We go for Litwick, and let's just hope we can throw our Ultra Ball, and let's hope he stays in there. All right, so we can see the poke uh, Pokeball yet again. That is one, that is two, that is three, and that is four. I think we got him. We've captured a Aaron, and he, our Litwick, just got some levels over here, and a level four, level five, a level six, guys. 
probably because seeing as how we captured a Aaron, he just leveled up really quickly. So I want to go back and just heal our Aaron, go back for our for the Nuzleaf, leaf, and then we have a pretty good team to be, uh, actually have on this server. So let's just go and do this as quickly as possible. Can we just jump over this river? Yes, we can if we just use those um, pets. But we're just gonna go and run over here. All right. Oh, this actually. Oh no way. These are two Pokemon fighting each other. Actually, I actually just noticed. All right, it's actually pretty cool. I want to. I actually want to be able to build something like that too. So uh, let's go over here and get uh, and heal our Pokemon and get back as qu uh, as quickly as we can. Seeing as how Nuzleaf only spawn at daytime, so if it becomes nighttime, we'll be in some trouble. Uh, so let's go back there and let's go and get the uh, and Nuzleaf. I also saw some Shiftery over there, but they are probably a really high level. Maybe if we find one of level. 22 or something like that i doubt there are any but if we do find one we're definitely gonna catch him let's go and cross the river over here and what pokemon was that i just saw oh it was nothing more than a red attack all right so we're gonna go and run back to the place where aaron was and i actually saw oh actually i think i saw a riolu at uh, uh i mean not a riolu um a robin rola right over there too when we just found the aaron so if we can find a real, uh, I mean a Robin Roller, then I'll actually be pretty happy. And I'm seeing two Nuzleaf or no, that's not a Nuzleaf. No, that, those are not Nuzleafs. Oh, a Sandal. But where are the Nuzleafs? I want one before the end of this episode. So is that a no? That is a. Oh, that's a Puchiana. Oh, actually, I think we can. If we do, we get a Mighty Yana if he evolves. So that would be actually pretty awesome. So. Actually, let's go and get this uh, Pokemon. I doubt there are any other really, really strong Pokemon. Let's go and use. Uh, let's go for a rollout, and he used Bite. Or we can take. Oh, he flinched, so we that was a problem, and our Chespin has fainted. Let's go for a Houndour. Let him use Ember. All right, so let's go using Ember, and it's not very effective, but still it has some effect. We're just gonna go and use a uh, use Ember once again. Got him in the yellow zone, and now we're gonna go and throw in a Ultra Ball. So let's go and just stick with Litwick. I mean, it doesn't matter, seeing as how Litwick isn't really a um, like a very good asset to us. So, or actually, asset, I mean, very good Pokemon to us. All right, so we got a we threw a Ultra Ball, and he broke free. Our Litwick has fainted. Uh, let's go for a Starly, and let's hope he doesn't uh, maybe ha he uses moves that a Flying type doesn't that it doesn't affect a Flying type. All right, waiting is long, guys. So maybe we have we captured a Puchiana. We got some XP. Now let's go for that Nuzleaf before the end of this episode, and then we we'll actually have a full team, full set of team. Um, where is oh? There's actually a evolution of Houndour. That looks absolutely awesome. The model really looks great. But actually, instead of going for a Nuzleaf right now, let's go and check our nature and uh, like. Our um, growth rate of our Pokemon. Let's go start with Chespin. His nature is rash, so his special attack has increased, but his special defense has decreased. So this is not a very good. Um, I don't think it's a actually. It is. I think it's just normal. I mean, uh, something good happened and something bad. So we'll just leave it at that. Let's go for Starly, and his stats are his nature is jolly. So I think that's pretty good. His speed is has uh, is pretty high, and his growth is ordinary. Uh, let's go to Houndour, and his nature is timid, and his growth is enormous, so that's pretty cool. I love enormous Pokemon, and his speed has just increased, and his attack has decreased. Attack doesn't really uh, attack doesn't really affect Houndour much, seeing as how he has mostly special attack moves, so that's great. And a little bit, I don't actually. I just go and check it out anyway. Nature is brave, so that is not very good nature for. Uh, Litwick seeing how he uses mostly special attack moves, I think. And Aaron, so this one nature is adamant. No way, we got a adamant Aaron, guys. So that is pretty awesome. And I think it is a very, I think it's the best nature for, I think Aaron, yeah, I think it's best nature for Aaron. He doesn't have a lot of special attack moves, he does have some uh, uh, actually a pretty um, uh, good amount of attack, normal attack moves. And his growth is small, the growth doesn't matter, the nature is adamant, guys. That is really, that's really cool. Alright, so let's go to Puchiana. His nature is sassy, his growth is huge, so his special defense has increased, but his speed has decreased. I think this is actually a, a, a really good team. I mean, there's a lot of uh, variety in them, like with the natures and all. So 
this is a really good start of this series and we have a pretty good team to start with i think i'm gonna remove litwick from our um from our team so uh we can add nuzleaf uh when we do and maybe even Star uh, starly after uh after that later on in this series but if you enjoyed this episode as long with everything that happened be sure to leave a like subscribe and a comment and i'll see you guys in the next episode bye bye